ankles, closer to the ankles first. And I'm going to get my book out for you. Okay, so we're going to stand up. We're going to not go on the ground today first. Let's do some standing stuff. Okay, I want you to concentrate on glute muscles. We're really going to use a lot of squeezing today in the glute area. Ten more. 
10, 9, 8, 7, reach out of your hip socket, 6, long down the front, up the back, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0, bring that in, nice first position. Check down the front of your legs to make sure that the two calf bumps of your calf muscles are looking at each other. And it's the bump of the bubble of the calf muscle and the flat line of this part of your legs that dictates how well you're turning up from your hips. Tailbone down, front stomach up. All of that stuff has to be in place and we can't let that go. Side of the big toe. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Keep pulling up the front. Nine, ten, ten, nine. Squeeze your hamstring into your butt cheek. Eight, seven, six, five, four. Squeeze it into your seat. Three, two, one. Zero. Bring it into first position. Find that nice line that's flat down the front of your calves because they're so turned out. Plie, knees over the middle toes, and release. You're letting your legs go down here, and then squeezing up on the inside. Down and out on the outside, up and in on the inside. Good. All right. Now, let's go back to the floor. Let's go to the floor. Do you have your ball with you? Your squeezy ball? Yep. All right. Hmm. so you're more forward than you're up, you are back. And we're going to lift and lower. One, down. Two, down. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, squeeze those butt cheeks as you lift, 19, 20. Now we're going to do 20 holds. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Woo! 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. That's number two. Three, two, three, four, five. In. Four, two, three, four, five. In. Five, two, three, four, five. In. Six, two, three, four, five. In. Seven, two, three, four, five. In. Eight, two, three, four, five. In. Nine, two, three, four, five. In. 10, 2, 3, 4, 5, in, 10, in, 9, hold, hold, in, 8, hold, hold, in, 7, hold, hold, in, 6, squeeze your butt cheeks, hold, hold, in, 5, squeeze the butt, and in, 4, and in, 3, and in two, and in one, and in. Excellent. All right, let's swing it all over to the other side. Good. Okay, so single lifts. Make sure your hips are stacked. Make sure you're more forward than back. 
One hip thrown on top of the other, knees bent. One, down, two, down, three, down, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Good, now it's the holds. One hold, hold, in. Two hold, hold, in. Squeeze your seat, in. Four, in. Five, in. Six, in. Seven, in. Eight, in. Nine, in. Ten, in. Ten, in. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, squeeze your glutes, four, three, two, one, and last one. Good job. All right, now let's get up to all fours. I'm just going to mute you because we're gonna, I'll put some music on. Hang on a second. Let's do some music.
seat, but just lift two, the two legs lightly off the floor, but with the emphasis on your hamstrings and your glutes and squeezing them up and in every time you tried to lift both feet off the floor. So that was a little bit different. I, did, I know I didn't have a microphone on to be able to talk to you through that, but that is what we were doing. Okay, so let's get your ball. Yes. And here we're gonna lie down on the floor. Oh, hang on a second. So I can hear feedback, so that's why I'm gonna mute. And you guys gotta be quiet. Okay. Alright. So I'm gonna use the ring. You can use the ball. Okay. Let's get it between, well you probably have it like between your calves or under your knees, just slightly under your knees. Good, let's, let's do parallel feet, parallel position, not turned out. So, I'm going, you're gonna lower them out to 45 degrees and reach up and lower and reach up. Now, just to talk to you about it, as you're reaching your feet pointed and they're in parallel, you're really going to think stretching out of this part, down and out the tops of your toes through that wall. Your glute muscles underneath, you are using and squeezing like crazy, right? Just like you got a ball up your butt, you got to squeeze. So we're only going to do little pulses. You're only going to be going, sorry, down and up, down and up. We're going to count 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, you got it. I'm losing my hat today. Okay, ready? Parallel feet. Get it in place. Reaching out of your hip socket, squeezing your butt cheeks. One, two, three, four. Little ones. Five. Six, reach through that wall. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, rest. Take it out. Woo, give it a break. Yeah, where do you feel it? Hopefully not in this part, right? In the top of your hip, right in the crease. I don't want any feeling of that. That's why you really have to stretch your toes like somebody's pulling your toes through that wall over there, okay? You have to pull out of your own hip sockets with your own legs, but at the same time, the reverse motion is up in here and squeezing really hard. Squeezing tiny muscles that you never squeeze very deep in the glutes. Okay, let's try it again. Parallel feet. Parallel feet. Reach and squeeze. One, two, three, four, reach out, five, six, stomach muscles and back, pushing on the floor, eight, nine, ten, rest, whoo-wee, got it, okay, a lot of stomach to and back pushing into the floor, right, because we're stabilizing so we don't hurt back muscles, we want to flat back, we're engaging our core, engaging the core, all right, so now we're going to do it in turnout. Two sets in turnout because this is a new one today. All right, calf got to go tighter. Turned out first position, second position, I guess. It's a little bit of a turned out. Reach it out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, pull it in, relax it, keeping it, now this is in turnout, right? So you're squeezing and wrapping your legs in your hip sockets, but squeezing the glutes like crazy. I squeeze the ball too, because the more you squeeze the ball with your inner thighs, the more that you can really reach out of your hip sockets from the top, okay? So that's really important. You don't want to strain, you want to stretch and reach out the tops of your hips. 
but use your butt cheeks hard. Got to be really, really squeezing. Here we go. Turn out in that position again. Keep them turned out, wrap. The calves are looking at each other. Squeeze hard. One, two, three, four, five. Reach through the wall. Six, your butt muscles squeezing. Seven, harder. Eight, nine, ten. Good. All right. I'm going to try another one. Experimental value. Okay. We're going to go turned out. Okay. Close to the floor where your ball touches the floor. You can get it so the ball is touching the floor. So your legs are pulling out. Okay, now just squeeze that ball. Squeeze it and point your toes and turn out and reach towards the wall. But just squeeze that ball really tight. 20 seconds. 19. 18, 17, reaching out the tops of the hips, squeeze underneath, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, keep squeezing, 6, squeeze the glutes more, 5 more, 4 more, 3, 2, reach through the wall, 1, 0, and relax. Woohoo! All right, we're going to do that one again. Just reaching those toes right out through the wall, but squeezing from underneath. All right, ready? Get it in position and squeeze hard. One, two, three, four, squeeze. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten more, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, two, one, zero, and we're out. Woo hoo! How you doing, Nemma? <laughs> Are you dying? Okay. Okay, we're gonna try it on our side now. We're gonna try something on the side. So, get your ball, put it between the legs again. This way. I've got the ring, it's a little bit more strategic. Okay, so we're going to lay on our side like this. And, and get the ball in between your knees. Actually, can you put it... Well, that's good. Now just make sure your top foot's not doing this. That's called sickly. Sickle. Pickle. Alright. Now... The under leg. You see my under leg? Lift and lower. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Rest. Got a cramp in my shoe. All right. Okay, so. Let's see. Keep it parallel. Keep yourself in parallel position. Bottom and top foot facing forward. Make sure your hips are stacked. Okay, we're going to lift and lower. Now, yeah, if you get cramps in your feet, you can totally flex. But I really want, again, the sensation of you reaching out down the top and squeezing hard in the back, right? Here we go. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten more. Ten while we're doing good. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six. Squeeze though. Five. Point hard. Four. Reach through the wall. Three, two, one. Nice job. All right. Now we're going to switch sides. Switch hippies. Okay. Parmesan? Yeah. yeah, Parmesan? Yes. Alright. Again, with the Pilates ring, it's a little strategic. 
Okay, so one, two, three, four. Lifting from the under leg. Five. Whoops. Six. Keep going. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Ten more. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. Uno. Zero. Good. All right. Take that out. Yes. Okay. Now, top leg in parallel. You swing it back behind you like this. And you're going to take it forward. Straight leg. And then center and down. Like that. So make sure your bottom leg is straight out and that your hips are stacked one on top of the other, that's it. And we just work in the top leg. So we go up, pointing it hard out of the hip socket. Reach it slightly behind and back. Come through center, come forward. Out to side, lower down. And two, back, through center, front, side, down. That's it. Keep reaching out those toes to the wall. One. Like really stretch. Pull it out. Two. Squeeze your glute in the back here. Bring it forward. Reach it out to that front wall. Side and down. Good. Up. Reach it back. Bring it forward. To the side and down. Good, now let's reverse it. We're going to go forward first. So you're going to go front. Stretch it all the way through to the back. Squeeze your glute muscles. Reach out the top of the leg. Out and down. Two. Forward. Side. Swing it back and reach. Squeeze your glute. And down. Three. Front. Through center, stretch and reach back, center, down, fourth one, forward, outreach, stretch it back, squeeze your glute, side, last one, up, forward, through center, reach your leg back, through center, and down. Woo, good job. I didn't do that on the other leg, did I? I just thought of it now, that's why. <laughs> All right, okay, now let's do, and now this isn't a clamshell, we're gonna bend the knees in. It's not the one where we keep the feet together and pull up like that. It's this one where you're just 90 degrees and you're coming down, like two, down, three, down, Four, down, five, down, six, down, seven, down, eight, and nine, and ten more, ten, and nine, and eight, and seven, and six, and five, and four, and three, and two, and one, and zero. Yes. Good stuff. All right, we gotta do that on the other leg. Gotta swing that around. So, go to parallel. And, leg stretched out, we're gonna do the, the up, Reach and stretch out the front of the hip socket. Center, front, side, down, up, back, center, forward, side, down, three. Stretch it back, stay on top of your hips. Center, 
forward, side, down, four, reach, center, front, side, down, five, five, reach back, bring it center, reach forward, side, down, really reaching it, pulling it out, good, now we're going to go in reverse, Reverse is up, front, center, squeeze the glutes into your upper, lower back, your hamstring into your lower back, down, front, center, back squeeze in your glutes, center, down, three, and back, center, down. Up, front, center, back squeeze, center, down, five, reach, center, squeeze in the glute, center, down. Good. All right. And now, bend the knees. And the full 90 degree leg up and down. Whoops, wait a second. I don't have my knees well enough. Two, down, three, down, keeping it sort of flattened up. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10. Yes, good. Holding that steady. All right. Now, if you have your ball nearby, or something to hold on to in your hands, we're going on our back again. toes flat on the floor. Keep your back as flat as possible down on the ground. Okay. You just hold your ball in front of you like this. Okay. And we're going to squeeze and lift off the floor and reaching out through the wall and lowering down. Just little squeezes. Two. Down. Three. Down. Four. Down. Five, down, don't, now control it. I want you to go smooth down. They only lift very little off the floor, but you're reaching out through the wall, down the tops of your hips. You are squeezing so tight, deep in your inner butt muscles. One, here we go. Two, three, four, five. Six. Hello, J Lo. Seven. Woo. Eight. Don't let it fall to the ground, Emma. Control it. You keep slapping your legs down. Oh, come on, going slow. You're slapping. Now, squeeze. Okay, so rest. That's how much. That's how much concentration you have to use down below because you should be able to smoothly lift and smoothly lower, not smack the floor. <laughs> Emma, what? Uh, two. No! Don't do that! <laughs> okay. <laughs> We're doing some more. Then I, again, I'm pointing hard. I'm reaching those legs through that wall. It's like somebody's got two of my legs and is pulling them. You know how I do that to you guys in class. So come and I'll pull your legs out as you're lowering. That's the feeling, right? Okay, so, and we're not bringing them up very high, but we're squeezing on the up and, and reaching out and squeezing as I lower too at the same time. Here we go. This is 
just to focus. Why do I do that? To keep strength in your upper body. Keep your stomach muscles tight. Here we go. One, squeeze. Two, squeeze. Three, squeeze. Four, squeeze. Five. Oh, that's way better, Emma. Good. Six. Seven, eight, I'm singing opera, nine, ah, come on man, squeeze that butt, ten, don't hold your breath, ah, good, ah. Ah. nice, nice job, all right, let's do this now, we're going to bring one knee into your chest, bring, let the other foot stay out stretched. Bring that knee in, but I really push your back flat on the floor and let that leg stretch out to the wall. Stretch it. Nice. Alright. Now we're going to swap legs. You stretch that leg out. Bring this one in. Really reach that bottom leg out to the ground. Flat back. That's it. Hold it. Let's switch, switch them again. Swap those legs again. Tight into the stomach. Reach that opposite foot out to that wall. Okay, now while we're holding this leg in here, we're doing the one legger. The one leg squeeze and lift a little bit from underneath my butt and then reach it out and down. Two and down. They're tiny. Three. Reach it out. Do not use the front of your hip. Four. You're stretching it out like somebody's got you like an elastic band. Pulling that leg through the wall. Five. Woo. Six. And seven. And eight. And nine. And ten. All right, can let that one go. Woohoo! Now we're gonna pull this one in. Stretch that leg, point it hard. Turn it out. One, down. Two, down. Three, down. Four, down. Five, down. Six, down. Seven, down, eight, down, nine, down, and ten, down, good, bottoms of the feet together, knees apart, back flat on the floor, now what we're going to do is just from here, you want to slide the feet out, and open the heat, open the toes so you go into like a fifth position, stretched out. Yeah, good. That is real. Calves are looking at each other. Now we're going to pull it in again. Back up. Oh, I'm taking my mat with me. Oh well. Hold it in like that. Bring the feet together. Keep the knees open. Relaxing into the floor on the side. Now we're gonna stretch it out. Take the feet so it's a, like it is, like you're standing in first position, flexed, all the way down on the floor like that. That's it. Good. Bring it in. Two, three, four. Back is down on the floor. Stomach engaged. Knees falling to the floor. Let the gravity just pull them down. And then I stretch, keep the feet together, try, and the heels flex as I'm standing in a first position out on the floor. Oops, caught by my mat. That's it. Okay, now, curling in and walking yourself up the sides of your foot. Go like that. <laughs> nice job, girl. All right. Woo! You didn't kill me as badly as you did the last day. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> How do you feel, though? How do your legs feel? So
sore. Oh, are they? Where are you feeling the soreness? Good, good, good. I, I, I want it there. I don't want it here. Remember, this is where we don't want it to grip and, and grab and hold. We want to use a lot of this and a few different ones today. Thank you, Malir. Have a wonderful rest of your day and say happy Mother's Day to your grandma and your mom, okay? Okay. Bye. Bye. Bye.